guys, I'm Tori Sterling. Welcome back. It's like 5.30 in the morning right now and I am about to go lift. I'm gonna do hamstrings and glutes. I'll take my camera and I'll see how brave I am to film it because you guys know that I get really like embarrassed filming my workouts. I just, I just do. Today's video is so kindly sponsored by Daily Harvest and I'm really freaking excited about it because Daily Harvest is something that I use and I really, really freaking support it and really believe in it. I'm gonna go to the gym. I literally look like a hot mess because I kind of just woke up. I look like a big yellow banana. <laughs> All right, I'm about to leave the gym. Of course, I didn't film it because it's I get so like self-conscious. I can't like film my workouts. I just, I don't know, I just can't do it. I'm not starving yet, so I'm probably just gonna make like hot lemon water and apple cider vinegar with some honey and get a little bit of work done. But it's really gloomy out and like I'm really weather confused because it's 59 degrees out and it's June. Like this, I feel like we never have like a cold June. This is really weird. My playlist is done, T God, because um, I have a couple errands to run in the middle of the day for another video, so I'm not gonna film that for this video, but you will see it in another video. And like I said, I have interviews today, so I kind of have like a weird timeline to do everything today. And it's 8.45 and I'm like starting to get a little more hungry. I'm kind of like in a work vortex right now, so I don't really wanna eat, but I know that I should eat. My new podcast just went up though. It was my um, How to Budget Your Life. So if you guys want to listen to that, it's always linked down below if you guys wanna stream my podcast, Manifest the Tori Sterling. I'm gonna make breakfast. What I'm gonna have is um, some fried eggs on avocado toast. And then I'm also gonna have a smoothie, and my smoothie's gonna be from Daily Harvest. Let's pick one. I want one with some greens. So I'm deciding between a mint cacao smoothie or a banana and green smoothie. Okay, this one has banana, cucumber, kale, spinach, lemon, and wheatgrass, which sounds so good. And this one has banana, spinach, cacao nib, cashew, peppermint, chlorella, and vanilla bean. I think I'm gonna do the mint cacao. Daily Harvest is kind of like a meal prep made easy for you and they provide nutrient dense, all plant-based meals delivered to your doorstep. And every single meal takes no longer than five minutes to make, which for me is so awesome because I'm literally so busy. Food is one of the last things that I wanna worry about even though it's one of my top priorities. I just, I don't wanna think about it. I just wanna have food that I know I like that is easily accessible to me and that's healthy and that's good for me and will make me feel good. What's really cool is that every single recipe is gluten-free and vegan and also they have zero added preservatives and additives. So basically you like go on the website and you build your own box. You can get like a weekly plan or monthly plan of nine, 12 or 24 um, cups. And you pretty much pick like the cups that you want and then every cup is created by a nutritionist and then every cup is developed by a chef. And then the box gets delivered to your door and you put it in your freezer like what you guys just saw me take it out of and uh, you take it out when you're ready to eat it. The only thing that you need is a liquid base with every meal, whether it's an oat bowl, a chia bowl, a smoothie, a harvest bowl. So I've been using Daily Harvest for the past couple of days and what I really like about it is that it's mindless and it's really convenient and easy. You don't have to think about, you know, is this healthy, is it good for me? Because all the ingredients are literally right here. I can pronounce every single ingredient. I'll show you guys the inside um, and you can see that you can literally see all the ingredients. Oh my God, it smells so good. You can see the spinach. You can see the cacao nibs on there. It smells like mint and oh my God, this literally is gonna taste like a milkshake. I haven't tried this one because I was saving it for this video. I had the banana and greens a couple days ago and I died. But yeah, I just like it because it's super convenient. It's super easy and it's affordable, guys. If you were to make this kind of like a meal plan for you, like you could order this box if you got 12 
12 it's about $90 and if you order it too and then on top of it all you would need if you're not vegan like me is like some eggs and protein that you can add into every meal and also some fresh like veggies so I have like spinach and kale on the side which you'll see me later I'm gonna add into a harvest bowl so obviously for the smoothies all you need is a blender you're gonna choose a liquid you can use whatever you want almond milk coconut milk coconut water you can use regular milk you can use regular water whatever you want I'm just gonna use coconut milk and you just pour it into the cup to the very top. This is just how I measure that I'm using like enough liquid. Kind of helps break everything up so that it's easier to put in the blender. And then you take this and you put it into the blender. Just like that. And then you blend it up. done looks delicious i'm so excited to taste it you can either put it back into this cup or you can use your own cup i'm just going to use their cup because it's one less dish for me to do and if you guys are on the go this has a cute little straw lid so you can put this on and then put like a straw through it but because i'm going to drink this at home i'm not going to do that all right like i said i've had daily harvest smoothies before and they've always been so good so i'm going to try this one Oh my god you guys this is literally it's literally like a milkshake it tastes so good i'm gonna make um avocado toast and eggs to go with this i think i'm just gonna have one because this is a pretty filling smoothie but if you guys want to try out daily harvest for yourself i'm gonna have a promo code linked right here and down in the description box down below and if you guys use that promo code you can get your first three cups free on your first order which is a really really great deal okay and here's my completed breakfast so this is just um an egg fried in avocado oil with avocado on an english muffin and then my daily harvest smoothie this entire breakfast took me no more than five minutes which is really really awesome so i'm gonna eat this and do some work and then we'll go get ready for errands i'm just gonna do like a little a less is more kind of makeup style but i just want to cover up my dark circles and whatnot so I'm just going to put on the Coconut Smoothie um, Priming Moisturizer. This is like one of their best products ever. If you guys were like kind of OG, you remember that I was talking about this like two years ago. I'm just going to throw on a little concealer. This is just MAC Studio Fix Concealer. And I'm literally just going to do a little, little bit. I'm just going to take a little bit of... Um, translucent powder and just set where I put the concealer. I'm just gonna curl my eyelashes and put on a little bit of mascara. And then just a little bit of um, Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. This is the best mascara. And they just came out with like a new mascara. It's at my mom's house. Oh, I should ask her to bring it. I'm gonna put a little bit on my lower lashes. I'm gonna um, heat up my straightening iron, straightener, whatever. And I'm just gonna change real quick. This is, this is what I'm wearing. It's just an Ocean City sweatshirt. These are just like American Eagle jean shorts and I'm wearing Snooks with them. My hair isn't bad, it's just a little like puffy. Every time I straighten my hair, Matt always says it sounds like a pogo stick, which it kind of does. All right, there you have it. That took me 15 minutes. And I was also texting in between, so it really only took me five minutes of effort, but now I'm done. So I'm gonna go run out on some errands, like I said. This is for another video that I'm running out on errands on. So you guys will see it on my YouTube channel. If it's not up already, it will be up very soon. But if it is up, I'll have it linked down below. See you later. All right guys, so I just ran some of my errands and I'm like striking out so much right now. And I wish I wasn't because I'm on like kind of a time crunch because I have other things to do. But I'm just not finding anything that I like. So I'm going to go run like one more errand and like try to find something else at this one other spot. And if I don't, Tyga interrupting me again. And if I don't, then I'm just going to go home and edit a video. All right, we're back from running errands. So I have to head to the studio in about an hour and a half or so. So I'm just going to whip up some lunch. And what I'm going to do for lunch today it's a harvest bowl from daily harvest so this is the daily harvest harvest bowl cauliflower rice and pesto the ingredients are cauliflower spinach basil olive oil cashew tomato lemon himalayan sea salt nutritional yeast and pepper mm. ingredients that you can read every single one of them i was gonna add in kale but there's spinach so i'm not gonna add in kale anymore but i am gonna add in chicken just because i teach tonight and i lifted this morning so i want to make sure i'm getting a good amount of protein while plant food does have protein 
I just find that I perform better in spin when I have a little bit more protein in my diet. So this is what the inside looks like of the little cup. So you can make these in the microwave or the stovetop. I've done both and I think they're both really good. Um, but I'm gonna do the stovetop today just because I have a little bit of extra time. But if I was like really, really rushing, which I normally am, I will just throw it into the microwave. I have a pan heating up right here. So you're just gonna pour everything in. Oh yes. So you kind of just let that mash up. And I'm cooking mine on medium heat. Pesto is literally one of my favorite things in the whole world and I'm on like a huge pesto kick lately. I haven't tried this bowl yet. Last night I had the sweet potato and wild rice bowl and it was so good. And I added in turkey meatballs to it. Oh my God, it was so good. So if you want, you can add in like one to two tablespoons of water or broth. I'm just gonna add in a little bit just to give it a little moisture to soak up as I am steaming it. And then you just let it do its thing. All right, I'm pretty sure it's done and that, like I'm not kidding, probably took three minutes. I'm gonna put this into my bowl. Yeah, this looks so good. Oh my God, guys, I just took like a bite from the spoon on like the spatula. Oh my God, so good. Hmm, I'm just gonna eat it all. I guess I can have a little bit while I wait. Oh my god, so good. This is what it looks like right now. The pesto is so good. Oh my god. Here just my chicken. I'm just gonna mix it all up. Oh my god, I'm so excited to eat. It's gonna be so good. Oh my god. You guys, this is so good. Like really, really, really good. Like I really am making this part of my grocery routine and to get these meals because it's so freaking easy and they're good and they're healthy. So yeah, if you guys want to get three cups free on your first order, use this code and link down below. I'm gonna go eat this in bliss and in peace. So I'll show you guys after. Guys, I just bought Kylie skin. I wonder if it's good. I mean, I've seen like Jeffrey's video and I've seen her Instagram. So obviously it's like two very different reviews, but I got it. So I'll try it. I just got the moisturizer, the face wash and the toner. I am about to go get ready to go to the studio. It's about 2.15. It's actually 2.20, so I have to leave here in like 25 minutes. Tonight will be fun. Like I know this vlog has been kind of like just bland up until this point because I've just been home working and stuff, but hopefully it'll get more fun now because I'm going to the studio, so I'll actually be around people. All right, this is what I'm wearing, and I actually just realized I'm 15 minutes behind. I should have left like right now, and I'm thinking I can leave in 15 minutes, but I have to leave right now, so I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. But anyway, this shirt, Straight out of Stride, it's um, Stride merch and it's sold out so you can't get it. Um, but I'm just wearing a Lulu Energy bra underneath of it. And then my pants are Lulu In Movement. These are my favorite pants for sweating at the moment. I go in phases of like these and Fast and the Free. But right now I'm really into the In Movement pants. Now I'm late and I didn't even notice that. Yeah, that's her. She's so cute. I shouldn't follow yet. No, oh my God, that's creepy. Yeah. Right? Yeah, it's or creepy. No, it's creepy. Why? Because we haven't interviewed her yet. I'll wait. Oh. Em, Jules, can you put music on, please? Oh, she's going to Hi, guys. Uh, how are we? Can I'm good, no, thanks for real. I just, um, I, hold on. So, Jess and I just did interviews, like yeah. I said. Kind of brought me back to when we used to do them. <sighs> like, I can roll those questions off my I tongue and recite them backwards that. in Spanish. And I still screw up. So do I. Specific words every single time. What Communi was mine? Communicative. Communicative. Or you know what's so funny? Everyone's okay. reaction is always, oh my, these are like really loaded questions. They are. They're the ones that your dad made, right? Yeah. And oh I'm like, my yeah, gosh. my dad made them. He's a psychologist. This is what he does for a profession. But I'm about to make a new video live. I don't know what I just did. I'll make it did it just story. put it in as completed? I just like swiped and it went away. I don't know. I always just write this stuff down in my notes. I always just say, hey Siri, your mind. Oh, don't do it, Siri. <laughs> hey Siri. You're at 1103 Route Stamp Road, Phoenixville, Pennsylvania. Thanks, baby. Hey Siri, set a reminder for me at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. Guys, I just uploaded a new video. Go watch it. There's some like techno playing up front. Oh, hey Jules. Oh, hey. What are you getting back here? <gasps> Who are we yelling at up front? Sis! Who's here? Sis. Hold on. Mary, did you get in? Yeah! Tampons. 
These are tampons. Okay, I have one girl licking next to me, one holding tampons. Welcome. Let's try it. I mean, dry shampoo by accident. Hi guys, um, it's me here. Oh, I do look kind of orange. What is this video? What? What's? Yeah, what's the title? Day in my life. Oh, I like so me. Day in her life. We are Tori's best friends. My name is Meredith, and this is Jules. And um, Tori's getting ready to go to class. We're gonna go spin. I'm not spinning. I'm working. And then we'll get some spin videos. <laughs> okay. Hello. Hi guys. I'm Emma. Happy Monday. We're, we're the front desk girls. <laughs> Uh, I work childcare. Um, liars. <laughs> I love strides. We love strides. <laughs> I don't really know how to stop this. Three, two, one, go right. Seven, back. Go left. First, next, kick. Come on, back. sure what the girls got. I know Jules was carrying the camera around, so I'm sure she got some good footage. But now I'm just on my way home from the studio. Lindsay is coming over because she has a hair appointment like right by my house. So she's just gonna come hang out with Matt and I. Anyway, it's raining, so I don't wanna vlog and drive in the rain, so I'll talk to you guys in my house. Goodbye. I don't think I was like it's girls night and I'm isolated. I'm behind enemy lines. I'll show you guys what I get from Wawa. Buffalo chicken sandwich. With ranch, cheddar cheese, Parmesan cheese. I get the buffalo chicken bites, as you can see, with ranch, and then I dip the sandwich in ranch too. I just, if it ain't ranch, it ain't me. I thought it's called a mukbang. Whatever you want it to be. Josh Peck calls them mukbangs. What does Trisha Paytas call it? I think that's Does what she call them a, a mukbang? Mukbang? I'm gonna eat and come back to you guys later. Yeah. Signing off. I just came on to say that I'm gonna end the vlog. Is there anything you want to say? Uh, I just want to use this opportunity to talk about saving the environment. All right, guys. I guess I love you all. I was just telling Tori how I was in like a spider's den today. I had to hang up wiring for a security camera at work. Or for like, there's like three security cameras that I have to hang up wire for, and it's like in the rafters of a warehouse. There's spiders like crawling all over my arms and everything. I've never seen like so many spiders like moving at once, just crawling on me. All right. Anyway, I am gonna sign off and say goodnight. Nope. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. Be sure to just follow me on Instagram. <laughs> you can follow Matt if you want on Instagram. Follow the podcast. Manifest with Tori Sterling. And I'll see all of you guys in my next video. Goodbye. Say bye. Sayonara. Goodbye. Peace and love. Yeah.